was like the bathrooms are really really nice so I was like wait what and then I actually went inside and I totally got what they meant so the bathrooms here rock FYI in case you ever wanted to visit <laughs> but basically um, the water was absolutely freezing I don't think that you would survive very long in this temperature <laughs> but um, those were at the waterfalls 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 it was still raining but we had an umbrella and my boyfriend took a lot of pictures with like this new filter that he got that makes the water look really cool so I had to hold an umbrella above the camera and not above us because the camera was obviously more important than we were <laughs> so um, this was a really 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 nice kind of hike it wasn't that long I think it was only like an hour but then we drove 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 to Berchtesgaden 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 which was um, where our second hotel is that was like maybe a two two and a half hour drive and this was our hotel 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 room I completely forgot to film in the evening so the next morning um, we walked 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 to a local bakery and had some breakfast there because sadly breakfast was not included in the hotel price and then we drove to Salzburg 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 in Austria because it was actually so cool that it was only like 25 to 30 minutes away so there was no way that we were missing out on that opportunity so here you can see the castle i guess you can say castle it's a book um but you can see the castle and we just walked to this really really nice like very open space so this book was a lot bigger than i had actually imagined and there was like this golden kugel like this gold ball i'm just gonna say and i actually thought for a second that the person standing on top of it is real spoiler it is not um walked through these really really cute uh streets and i found an american candy store and i got very excited and then i saw the nerds and i was sold so i had to go inside unfortunately the hot cheetos cost five bucks but the nerds were still affordable so i totally got those and i snacked on those in this beautiful 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 park this is the what is it the mirabellen garden i think it's called it was super super colorful and i loved like contrast to the like cloudy weather and now I present to you this statue and I'm just gonna leave it at that <laughs> so then we um, went shopping for a little bit I um, bought way too much and then we went grocery shopping when we got back when we got back when we got back to our hotel 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 and just sat on the balcony and ate like a little dinner that we prepared for ourselves so then the next morning the finally clearing up this was the first time in like almost a full week that we actually saw the sky like a blue sky so we went we went we went we went we went to another cafe for breakfast and then we decided to go to the Wimbachklam Wimbachklam so then um I had a really funny hair tie in my hair so I was just laughing at myself um because my shadow looked so weird <laughs> but then um I just took so many videos because honestly the nice weather was really motivating me so we had to pay a little bit of an entry fee but it was definitely worth it I feel like this looked so much prettier with the sun than it would have in a rain so I was just super super excited <laughs> so it was like a short walkway I think this is only like seven or eight hundred meters long but it felt a lot longer a lot longer a lot longer because um yeah probably mainly because my boyfriend stops every two seconds to take a bunch of pictures but it's fine it's fine it was definitely worth it so there were just a bunch a bunch a bunch of like really pretty waterfalls that just were like oh, i don't know i was just so impressed and we had these guest cards again 
as you can see. Yes, the sun definitely came out and the sky was so clear. There was literally not a single cloud in the sky. And I had a pretzel with butter and there was so much butter in it. So I, th I thought I should share that grossness with you. <laughs> then we drove to the Königsee, Königsee, Königsee. Um, and I had to go through this like cute little village and it was so full. Like, <laughs> that was the actual demonstration of how full it is when the weather is actually nice. So we went on this boat ride, boat ride, boat, 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 on this boat ride, boat ride, boat ride, across the river, not river, across the lake, I think it's eight kilometers, eight, 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 eight kilometers, and there was like a tour guide that told us a bunch of information about um, this lake, I think it's like the second deepest lake in Germany, but yeah, it is absolutely beautiful. super exhausting ASMR video, we decided we needed a break. I'm just kidding. Um, but we started to hike to this really, really nice waterfall. It's actually the tallest, tallest waterfall in Germany. And as we were hiking, we like saw a bunch of cows and a lot of people like very close to these cows. So I was like, wait, what? Because I always thought like you're supposed to keep your distance. But one cow actually came super, super close to me. So I decided to like very carefully pet it. And it was super nice. We it was super nice. They had like big bells around their necks, so they were very, very loud. So it's not like they could sneak up on you anyways. But yeah, this is the waterfall, waterfall, water, 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 waterfall. Um, there, the path like actually ended here, but we decided to go a little bit further until we recognized that it was actually really, really dangerous <laughs> because everything was kind of slippery and it wasn't like an actual path like I said, so we kind of just turned back at half point. So yeah, we just hiked all the way back, all the way back until we found a really, really cool restaurant because we were both absolutely starved from all that walking. <laughs> and then we um, had to wait for a boat to come pick us up, pick us up, pick us up. And when we got back, I ate another scrambled pancakes <laughs> and my boyfriend got some ice cream. And then when it was dark, when it was dark, when it was dark, we actually decided to photograph the Milky Way and it was supposed to be like really clear so you could actually see it with your bare eyes like it was super super pretty and we saw a couple shooting stars as well so here you can kind of see the picture that he took um, I think you kind of get the picture but yeah it was kind of creepy walking around at like midnight but it was very very fun <laughs> and it was a great way to end our vacation 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 so the next morning so much for watching everybody.